guys welcome back to my channel so I'm back today again and yeah but anyway so today I'm doing sort of my everyday makeup um, tutorial this is literally what I do to go out I don't really do much with my eye makeup I like to keep it very neutral and simple but I do like popping up my you know dramatic eyelashes or whatnot and I do love pairing it with like a bold lip usually it's dark um lips because I just like black and I like dark lips and yeah so that's just kind of my style but um yeah so that is what I did today and I'm going to show you guys how I get this whole look how to get a really nice skin for the spring I mean for the fall and winter season because I do have combination skin so I do get a little bit of you know dryness um, so yeah and also I'm going to let me just show you guys this right here wait 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 so this right here is the Jackie Aina, my mother. If you guys didn't know, Jackie is my mom. And yeah. <laughs> but anyway, so this is her collaboration with Artist Couture. And she came out with her highlighter called Le Bronze. And then in this whole holiday kit, um, there's four other highlighters from Artist Couture. This is her favorite. So this is Jackie's pick. Um, but yeah, this one right here this one Jackie's highlighter I'm wearing it today guys Fuck. Fuck. um but yeah so I'm going to be using this today and I'm just so happy for her so congrats a lot Jackie mom mom congrats mom I'm going to be using the LA girl cosmetics shady slim brow and I'm using the shade um uh, what is it blackest brown and espresso so i like to use these two colors and snatch my brow so let's go ahead so the first pencil that i use is the darkest brown i think it's blackest brown yeah so i just use that to outline my brows and whatnot and then i'm gonna fill the tail a little bit then I'm gonna go ahead and take espresso to fill the front so we get that gradient effect so it's not all the way dark from beginning to end and I also fill the rest of the brows with the espresso so to clean up my brows I like to take this Anastasia cream contour and I take this dark shade right here and just clean my brows up I just break that concealer down, then I blend it out. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean the top. Now you don't have to clean the top if you already have like brows and everything like that, but you guys know that I don't have any brows, so to get my brows to actually show, I have to use concealer on the top and the bottom. I'm just gonna take that spoolie and brush my brows. So basically, that is it for my brows. I'm gonna go ahead and do this one off camera and I'll be right back. Head and do our face makeup. The first thing I'm going to do, of course, is prime my face. And I like to use the Scandinavia Primer Spray and this is oil control. So I'm gonna dress my face. Yes. Right now I'm applying this strobing based primer by Black Up Cosmetics. And this just gives my skin a really nice glow and it also makes it really moisturizing soft for our foundation to go on. Just wanna snack your face. You don't have to do that, guys. I cried a little bit, not too much. Some on my nose, some right here on my scurry. Okay, so for today, I'm going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hill Stick Foundation in Cool Earth, and this is what it looks like. 
You can't even tell I'm putting anything on. For this foundation, I like to use my flat brush to blend it out. And then I'll go over it with the beauty blender. Okay, so to conceal my under eyes, I'm going to be taking this foundation. This is actually a foundation and this is by Basmanham Cosmetics. Um, I'm going to leave the link down below. I don't know what shade this is. It doesn't say, but I'm going to be using that as my highlighting um, concealer. And it's very creamy. It's so nice. Okay, so I'm gonna go back in the brush and just blend around the edges so everything is blended together the concealer and the foundation. Okay, so to contour around my face and bring back some color, I'm going to be using the Allegra foundation in the shade um, Dark Chocolate. And this just really helps your makeup um, last longer and look flawless for a really long time. So, yeah, we're gonna carve out the contour. The first shade I'm going to be taking is this one right here. It's called Transition. And I'm actually gonna use that as my main lid color. So I'm gonna go ahead and take Thanks Latte, which is this shade right here, and I'm gonna put it on my brow bone just to kind of highlight it. I'm gonna take the shade Brownie, Brownie Point, and just kind of shade this in. King of the city cause I wear that gold crown So give it up for bad man better than bad man I didn't and just dogs and kill the dust this man. off and set the rest of my face man. When I get on stage all they do is clap man So make you join me in my Bugatti Join me in my Bugatti Only you in my Bugatti Only you in my Bugatti See my Jeep Seeger She's something to myself I'll comment on um, someone asking why do girls put fall lashes, fall lashes and then go ahead and put mascara on it. We don't actually put mascara on the falsies, we put mascara on our real lashes so it's blended because when you do your makeup you do get powder on your lashes so you can actually see it. So when you use your mascara, you just blend it all in and yeah. That is why we put um, mascara after putting lashes. Ooh. So what do I do now? Oh wait, I remember. I'm gonna spray my face. Yeah, so I'm gonna dip in there. I'm like, Jackie. Oh my god. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Shalom, girl. What are you doing? I'm not using the right brush. Wait, wait. And now we're gonna put someone on nose. You know. 